Hello Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly couples reading for May 2020. Before I start, I'd like to thank everyone who have subscribed to my channel. Those of you who have liked, shared and commented, thank you all so much for your support. For those who would like to book a private reading with me, please do check my about page. I now have an ST shop. All the information you need is there and also in the description box below. Once I hear from you, I'll get back to you as soon as possible. So this month, um, Sagittarius, you're going to have three cards for the beginning of the month, middle of the month and end of the month because last month I did change the um the reading for the general reading so this month i just want to just um do something different that's all but we have our general uh all our main energy as normal and we'll just see what's going to happen for the beginning middle end of the month so yeah let's go okay so tarot and universe please tell us what is coming for sagittarius couples okay i will accept that okay Knight of Cups. I will accept that. Yes, so. Okay, so let's see what the Knight of Chalice here is all about. Okay. Um, modesty. Okay, we're talking about modesty. So, um, I feel here some type of um sexual arousal or trying to make your partner find you attracted by trying to be modest something like that shyness something like that okay that's how i'm going that's that's how I'm, I'm feeling it here and so we're going to see okay tarot and universe please tell us what's come for sagittarius couples for the month of may okay how is the first week looking beginning of the week it's the middle of the week looking towards the end of the month yes okay okay the bottom deck is ten of cups okay 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 so the first card is Knight of Wands reversed. Second cup is the Queen of Wands. And your third cup, sorry, your third card is the Two of Swords. Sorry, is the Ace of Swords reversed. Okay. So, what do what do we see here? Well, with the Ten of Cups here as your base, I feel here there is something that um, you will be trying to achieve, okay? What you'll be trying to achieve here is calmness and, um, how do I say it, happiness. Um, you want to feel more fulfilled. And I feel for most of you here, you are um, already living together. Or most of you are living together and I feel here there is a bit of tension here okay and also that is why I also feel some of you are trying to be modest I feel in terms of your conversation but um, and how you know you present yourself to your partner because this is the king uh, knight of cups okay so um, here I also feel that you know, as we see here, there's something that this woman is trying to hide or trying to protect or defend. So I feel some of you will try and be defensive in terms of what you be discussing with your partner. That is how I see it here. Okay. Um, yes, 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 yes. So at the beginning of the month, you've got the Knight of Wands reversed. Here, I feel a lot of things are going to go very, very rapidly because this is this knight is impatient, okay? He is impatient. I feel, you know, in the beginning of the month of May, things are going to be a bit too, too fiery, 
okay it's going to be a bit too fiery for you guys and you are going to try your best to correct it and i feel like um i think there's going to be some type of sexual tension as well that is how i see it here okay and um in the middle of the month we've got the queen of wands which obviously um is your energy okay because your energy here your energy here i feel that here um yes you'll find more balance in the middle of the of the month okay uh you will be yourself you will be more calm but i also feel like having um this ace of swords reversed in your you know towards the end of the month i feel whatever decision you make may not go right for you because i also feel it's got something to do with the venus retrograde so um so yeah just be mindful of any decision you are making concerning your relationship because things might not go as you you want it okay or you might not be thinking right so whatever decision or discussion you'll be having with your partner um there's a chance that they will not understand you how you want it so um yes when venus is in ret retrograde um definitely things are not going to be all that smooth in most relationships however um that doesn't mean life shouldn't go on life will have to still go on and i feel like yes um you've you know you've still got something to look forward to okay um at least you have knowledge now and wisdom on what to expect okay so yes um sagittarius i will leave your reading here and um this is a very quick reading I will see you next month or you will see me next month.